a 13-year-old Nadine Corey getting beat up, dragged through the streets, put in a tree, and then hung from a fence post by seven schoolmates. And the fact that some onlookers didn't help proves that bullying is a problem that many are too afraid to deal with. Please welcome Nadine, Nadine. his mother. Nadine. I'm sorry. Nadine. Nadine? Yes. Okay, Nadine. you don't mind if I said Nadine, Nadine, right? Nadine. Okay, we're all friends. Nadine, his mother, Rebecca, and his stepdad, Eric. So, <laughs> these kids were bullying you. The, the school goes up to the 12th grade. Okay. Mm -hmm. You come there, you're working hard, you're a pretty good kid. What are they picking on you for, and what did they say to you? Um, they'll mess with me because I'm, the, I'm one of the smallest ones, and because when we first moved around the area, they saw that my mom was African, and they made fun of my mom a lot. They made fun of your mom because mm -hmm. she was an African and because mm -hmm. she had dark skin accent. and an mm -hmm. accent. And, and what did they say to you in the beginning before they did this um, really awful thing? They used to just come over and say smart things. They'll um, say, they'll call me names and then they'll go over back to their friends and make fun about it. And the teacher would just sit there and just watch and not say anything. The teacher didn't do anything. Mm -hmm. So on January 11th, mm -hmm. seven older boys from this school attacked you, dragged you mm -hmm. on the ground, put you on a, on a tree, you, you fell off, mm -hmm. they put you up again. What did you do? Did, did you scream? Did you try mm -hmm. to fight back? What yeah, was, for, what, what, um, what at was first, like? at first um, my friend had just told him to just leave me alone, but then they did it, and they tackled him. Uh, um, after he tried to tell them to leave me alone, they tackled him. And then I, I was calling for help, and like three other people walked by, and none of them did anything. The first person had walked by at first and thought we were just playing. When, that's when, uh, and then when it was all done, she had uh, um, helped me get from off the gate, and then she had took me off. Let me, I, I just want to know, name is... How long had this been going on? How long um, had these guys been? Since the year, since September. This since is, last September. This is the no, third this time September. It's this yeah. September. Yeah. Yeah, before yeah. Yeah. These boys, the, the bigger boys who, who did this to you, hmm. uh, were, were just arrested. What do you hmm. want to happen to them? Um, I want justice to happen. I want, to, I want something equivalent or even more for what they did to me, I want it to happen to them. Well, they're not going to be hung from a tree. No, no, I'm talking about uh, um, punishment. You want them laws. to be punished mm -hmm. by law. Yeah. By law. Yeah. Absolutely. Yeah. Can I ask you? Oh, I'm yeah. sorry. Yeah. I just wanted to ask you a question because you and I had a slight conversation mm -hmm. earlier. Tell me what you want to be when you grow up. A Marine. A Marine. <laughs> and I just want to point out your sister sitting over there. She wants to be an OBGYN. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I just want to point that good out. Future ahead of you. <laughs> you know? I see a marine in you. Yeah. I'm sure do. You know, I, so Chrissy's point, a lot of 13 year old young men would maybe not even want to talk about this. Mm -hmm. What made you want to come here? What's your message? Um, maybe if other people can hear what, what happened, maybe somebody can step in and help. Maybe somebody can help stop it. Maybe because next time it's not just going to be me. It's going to be somebody else. Somebody, somebody smaller than me. Some, maybe the other people are going to be bigger than them and somebody can really get hurt. How scared were you? Um, I'm really scared. Um, I, was, I was scared for my life. I thought when they was putting me on the gate, I thought maybe it, um, it would poke my body or because under, under the gate is like, it's more twist like a little pool in the gate. So I thought I was going to fall in there. I was going to hurt my neck or something. You are an extraordinary man. Thank you. you really are. You're so brave. You. And you know, not only did we think that, we did a little research. Because you mean a lot to us now and forever. And we know that you're a huge Philadelphia Eagles fan. And uh, some in this, uh, in this uh, audience here. And there are some guys here that also want to tell you just how brave you are. Please welcome Pro Bowl wide receiver Deshaun Jackson, center Jamal Jackson, and God. Deshaun changed his plans. Everybody changed their plans because they wanted to make sure that they were here to be, to be with you.
Well, um, you know, first off, uh, you know, we're we're very blessed to be here. And, uh, you know, I was just sitting back in the back room, you know, looking at the video, man. And first and foremost, man, I want to say you're brave because uh, this happens every day. And, and people are not, you know, brave enough to stand up and, and take this on. And, um, you know, man, bro, for real, you're doing it, man. And I just want to say, man, I appreciate you, bro. For real, man. Hey, right, this for you right here, bro. Anytime ever you need us, I got two linemen right here, man. Anytime you need some man, my boy's ready to come put it down, man. Definitely. Anything ends up happening again, you just let us know. We got you. Hey, we got, we hey. got a lot of wet eyes right well, now. Well, we'll fall away. Yeah, we'll us fall too. Fall away. Just so you know, us too. That's right. That's even more power. You know. So what do you think about this? Um, I want to thank all y'all for uh, what y'all did, um, taking time out of your lives to come yes, see man. me. Um, just so you know, me, my favorite player on the whole Eagles <laughs> team. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know if they're calling this or not, but, but we, we're going to hook it up so you can come to any game you want this year with thank your family. You.